Hello and welcome to the fifth update. Uh, not so much about the EVA platform, but about the easy mode this time, because I get a lot of questions and uh, realize that I realize that um, there may be not enough detail on how to assemble the thing. It's quite straightforward. The easy mode is really about the um, arrangement of the X rail and uh, on the original one it's vertical, over here it's ver horizontal and it's supported by this 2020 uh, profile over here. I slapped two uh, EVA carriages uh, over here to show you the uh, sizes that it can achieve. So looking at the BMG one over here it's homed per se. So in X from one end to another you have 300 millimeters from if you want to go really uh, tight if the end stop allows that and all that you'll have more than 300 and then in Y you'll have 300 millimeter millimeters easily with the 90 degree angled EVA and carriage back you can go further than that if you need it, like 320, let's say, would be safe. And then for Z, if I can grab the bed, you go as low as the shaft couplers for the lead screw, the screws uh, allow you to. So here's 300, but you can go a little bit low, lower than that, like 320 again, 320. Uh, on my Pro, that's uh, behind my back over there, I made, uh, I guess at this point, a mistake of taking the uh, 2Z version, so I don't have the rail on the back, and um, the bed assembly can be kind of achieved on your own, like it's not a part of easy mode mod. Um, but yeah, something you just achieve with shorter MGN rails because they have to be short enough not to and not to be in the way of of the X gantry when it's moving back and forth. So shorter than the other ones. Over here I have uh, 400 millimeters. You need two Y beams over here. Those are four. 160 millimeters to support the Z beam over here and its length mine are 359 because those are the ones I had from the previous versions of my Vicor uh, but those can be you get you get a lot of wiggle room over here you may need shorter ones if you want to fit a taller uh, Nima stepper for example like you see over here in the project I have a 48 millimeter NEMA over here but mines are 40 so uh, you can see this error over here it comes from that for the back if you have such a if you have the third rail and you want to use it you can use the original um, 500 millimeter one I assume uh, supported by a uh, 420 millimeter uh, Z profile on the back but it's not as simple as that as you can see the motor plate would need to have a cutout over here so either you use your angle grinder and imagination to achieve that or you move this plate with the lead screw not to be at the very center uh, of the uh, of the frame basically So with this, you would have this moved a little bit to the right, maybe the rail to a little bit to the left, and then you would need a part which I don't have. Let me know in the issues for easy mode over here if you need one. Upvote if you see that issue already. Um, but yeah, let me know if you want me to to make something like that, and I'll try to 
to do it. It won't be tested because I don't have the third rail uh, online. So someone would have to uh, someone would have to test that. Mm, what else? Yeah. So you need two Y beams, 460 millimeters, two Z uh, profiles, 360-ish less than that if you have taller motors uh, the one in the back 420 and one for x exactly 394 millimeters to get that and to make it all neat and tidy i would assume you would get those from uh, ratrick which is the current price uh, to get those cut to the exact dimensions that you need um, but any of those would work if you get the um, if you get the T um, the T profiles which I uh, talked about last time you would be able to for the X uh, at least you would be able to use the smaller MGN uh, twen 12 uh, rail to have your gantry a little bit lighter so yeah, I guess that's it. The bed is uh, 330. So I slapped this uh, pad over here to uh, to imitate the build space in X and Y. Okay. Let me know if you have more questions. I'm at uh, Ratrix's uh, Facebook uh, community group. I'm also at the unofficial Discord server uh, that we made uh, about Ratrix. If you if you have any more questions or need more direct conversation, um, you can find me there. But again, the best way for me not to forget about a request is to file an issue on GitHub where you can find the easy mod project and the Eva project. Okay, thank you everybody. Uh, see you later, bye.